Uh, so our burger's cooking away, but the, the really interesting element to this is homemade a cheese sauce. So cheese wizard, <laughs> if cheese you will. Wizard. Cheese, wizard. cheese wizard sauce. So we have in our pot right here, we have some milk that's cooking, and we're simply gonna put some cheddar cheese into, nice, our, sharp yellow in, cheddar. into our milk, yeah. And we're gonna we're basically gonna make like a sauce like you would for like a macaroni and cheese. Right. All right, that's gonna melt into our, our milk. And then that's gonna you know dissolve. And then what, what we have here is this cold mixture. So milk and some cheddar so cheese. So we just cook the milk down, melt the cheddar into the milk, and then where's it going? Super simple. Then we're gonna put it in one of these. So this is a siphon. You see these when you go to the you see this when you go to the coffee shop. They, they put whipped them. cream on your on your coffee drink. And they have right? them at the regular hardware store. They have them down to the ace. My husband has one of these because he I told you he loves the He's into it. He's got all he's of really the tools. Into it. He's got, he's got all, all the of the stuff. tools. So instead of whipped cream, we're making whipped cheese basically. So this cheese wizard, if you will. So we put our cheese sauce into the siphon. And these you can find at a lot of local stores now. They're, they're relatively inexpensive. Um, so again, the tool of the modern chef, but quite honestly, um, everyone can cook like a modern chef. Right? And like I said, they're at and the coffee shop. Yeah, so you these can things literally are, get these anywhere now. Yeah, they're in your everyday life. You make your life. own homemade whipped creams and all that. And then we're gonna, we're gonna charge it up. And what this does is it's gonna actually inflate the sauce in there. And you always wanna charge those sort of upside down. All right, shake it up, and then Give I have one shake, back here. And then you chill it yeah. out. You're gonna chill it for a little bit, throw it in the fridge for 10 or 15 minutes. And what we're gonna do is we're each gonna dress our own burger. We'll put we the so, uh, patties on the yeah, so sandwich size. I'm, I'm, I'm using sauce. an English muffin because- I love English muffin burgers. Good, te good, good texture to it, so. The patty pals right there. We have the, the patties here. And maybe, can you throw some of those caramelized onions? I want sure. onions on mine, that's just- Yeah, I love onions. Beef um, and onions, it's sort of like tomatoes and basil. It works, it works well together. I love throw onions. Throw this on yours. Yeah. All they're right. in, they're, they're down with the onions. They're down with the onions, all right? Let's see. Uh, we got some bacon over there uh, we can throw bacon. on. I'm gonna just go bacon on mine. I know there's tomatoes over there. Yeah, for we'll this, it's the summertime. Them. We can put some tomatoes on there. Yeah, why not? Mine. And then really though, the key element, now we have our cheese uh, wizard. I'll go first and then you can go. So this all is right. kind of fun too. Um, now this could get crazy, like I could squirt this all over the place. So um, that's why which, that's you know, why we bring it. It's, it's, a it's cheese, literally a blast. It's a cheese comes. wizard party, but now we have this whipped cheese. Whoa! You want to give it give it a shot? Right. That Look at is that! Awesome. Extra cheese! Extra cheese!